Hi, this is Annette with DigitalPhotographyHowTo.com and today we're going to learn how to whiten the eyes and teeth on a portrait. This is a bridal picture that I took a while ago. You can see it right there. And she doesn't really need her eyes whitened or her teeth whitened, but I am going to show you how to do it anyway on her. So what we're going to do is we're going to come over here and we're going to grab the lasso tool. Okay, and then we're going to come over here and we're going to just draw and choose the whites of her eyes. Okay, now we can come over to this eye right here and you can see when you hit either the shift key that has a little plus sign by it the control key turns it to a mover so you can move it around and the alt key subtracts so we're going to hold the shift key because we're going to add to that selection over there so we're going to draw around here okay and then we have the two parts of our eyes right here now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up to image adjust and hue saturation okay now I'm going to choose reds because I want to try to get rid of this red right here on her eye and so I'm just going to pull the saturation down just a little bit and maybe the lightness down just a little bit of the reds you can see that it's kind of whitening it up in there and I'm gonna go back to master and I might just lighten it slide it to the right a little bit now I'm going to cancel this because what I want to do first is feather this right here so that it's not a solid stripe blunt line where I highlighted her eye. I'm going to feather it so that the color kind of fe feathers and fades out. So I'm going to go to edit sorry not edit we're going to go over to select feather and we want to use a really small radius. So I'm going to just choose five, click OK. And then I will go up to Image Adjust Hue Saturation. And I might even just pull the lightness over. And you can see that it brightened up her eyes just a little bit. And I'll click OK. I'll go up here to Select and Deselect, and it will take it away. Now you don't want to you don't want to change the color too much because they'll just pop out and that's the only thing you'll be able to look at. So now we're going to do the same thing with the eyes. Now I'm going to use my Wacom tablet. I have a Wacom tablet with a pen and that helps me make more precise selections. Um, you can do it with a mouse but it's just a little bit harder. So I'm just going to follow her gum line. Okay, now I'm going to feather this a little bit, so we'll go up to Select, Feather, OK, and then I'm going to go back up to Image, Adjust, Hue Saturation, and I'm going to lighten it just a tiny bit, maybe to 10 or 11. I'm going to click OK, Select, Deselect, and there you go. She has a little bit wider teeth, and it doesn't look so bad. It doesn't look like I did it on purpose. It just looks totally natural, but just a little bit better. So there you go. There's some easy portrait touch-ups for you. Come back for more tutorials.